Hey everybody, T-Man or Lizard Wizard here, and I am back with more Undertale. Last time, a lot of stuff happened, and today we are going to go and talk to Alpheus. We are going to talk to El Alpheus. Uh, question. Cell, dimensional box. Yep. So, last time we technically beat the game, but we need to go back and talk to Dr. Alpheus on level L1. I knew that I, I wanted to do that last time, but I thought it would have been alright. Apparently not. <laughs> that's the elevator. Like, from Willy Wonka. At least that's what I think. So. I... I can't believe that ending, man. That was... That was very weird. This... Judging by how there's a second ending, I'm gonna hate myself after playing that, aren't I? <laughs> oh, the places I'll go. Come on. We gotta go back. Hey, uh, is this this is Undyne? Shut up, Papyrus. This was your idea. Human, you have a deliver. You have to deliver something for me. Uh, please? It's... I'm at Snowden, in front of Papyrus. It's... See ya, punk. Huh. What? Okay, I, I guess. Now, how am I gonna get there fast? Hmm. What the... Metaton looked really, really cool in that dress. <laughs> sort of makes me feel like I could wear one, too. Yeah, don't. That... that is... that is weird. It's changing the world. Yay! Nice cream! I have to go check on Dr. Alpheus first. Maybe I can go get to that dog er that that dog log. <laughs> dog log. Anyone read Redwall? You know that book that is extremely long. It just makes me think of that. Log a log a log a log. Hey, look at the dog. Yes. I would like to go to Snowden. Off we go. Do, 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 do. Tra la la, the piano plays the tinkling song. Mmm, tinkling. That sounds like he's using the bathroom. Ah. Uh, like, that ending surprised me. I'm actually quite surprised by it, and, and I'm still going. Oh. Where are you? Duh. Da 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 Undyne. Um, so, I have a favor to ask you. Uh, I might need you to deliver this letter. To Dr. Alphys. Huh? Why don't I do it myself? Uh, well... It's kind of personal, but I'm a friend, so... I'll, I'll tell you... Hotland. It sucks! I don't want to have to go over there. So here you go. Oh, and if you read it, I'll kill you. Thanks so much. You're the best. Yeah, I'm going to choose not to read it. Because there's a high chance that Elpheus is going to read it out loud, because that happens a lot with characters in video games. They'll read stuff aloud. Yes, I shall ride in the boat. Let's go to Hotland. What's he gonna sing today? Hmm. I should have worn a few more pairs of pants today. I don't wear any pants, so ha! I wear shorts. They're different. 
<laughs> yeah, you thought you you thought I was gonna do a Markiplier and just wear no pants all the time, huh? No, I wear shorts. There's a difference. Let's save quit quick. Seeing such a strange laboratory fills you with determination. That's I'm still surprised about that one ending. I'm glad I captured it. Slide the letter under. He slid the letter under the door and gave it a knock. Uh, oh, oh no, is this another letter? I don't want to open it. Can't, can't I just slide it back out? No, no, I can't keep doing this. I'll read this one. Um, it, it's shut kind of strongly, isn't it? Wait a second. Hey, if this is a joke, it's... Did you write this letter? It wasn't signed, so I had no idea who could have. Oh no. That's adorable, and I, I had no idea you uh, wrote that way. It's surprising, too, after all that gross stuff I did. I don't really deserve to be forgiven, much less, uh, this. And so passionately, too. I think we have a misunderstanding on our hands. You know what? Okay, I'll do it. It's the least I can do to make it up to you. Yeah, let's go on a date. What? No! No! I'm not old enough. Well, I actually am, but I don't want to. Please don't. sense of uh anyway <laughs> this is so bad wait actually we still can't start the day yet dating stop <laughs> um i've got to give you items to raise your affection statistic first that'll increase the chance of success whole outcome of the date right anyway don't worry, I'm, I'm prepared. I've been stockpiling gifts in anticipation for a date like this. First, I've got some metal armor polish. Um, maybe you can't use that. But, I also brought some waterproof cream for, for your scales. Your, uh, scales. <laughs> well, how about this magical spear repair kit that I, uh... Hey, let's forget about the items. Let's just start the date. <laughs> Dating start! Yeah, let's uh, date. <laughs> I love it. Yeah, there's a there, there's a slight slight problem. The problem is that I'm a mute character and I can't talk to you. Uh, do you like anime? Well, personally, I've never watched anime besides Howl's Moving Howl's Moving Castle, which I thought was pretty good. So yeah. Hey, me too. Awkward. Hey, uh, let's go somewhere. There, but there's a good place to go on a date. I've got it. Let's go to the garbage dump. What? Here we are. This is where Undyne and I come all the time. We find all sorts of great stuff here. <laughs> She's really, uh... Oh no. That's her over there. I can't let her see me on a date with you. Why? Because, uh, well... Oh no, here she comes! Hide behind the trash can! Hey, there you are. I, uh, realized if you deliver that thing, it might be a bad idea. So I'm gonna do it. Give it to me. Huh? You don't have it. Ugh. Have you at least seen her? Yep. Yes. So she's somewhere around here? Thanks. I'll keep looking. I've got to! Yeesh! Well, I, I guess it's obvious, huh? Uh, well, I really like her. I mean, more than the other, like other people, but I'm sorry. I just figured, you know, it'd be fun to go on, like, a cute kind of pretend date with you to make you feel better. <laughs> yeah, you're lying, aren't you? Well, it sounds even worse when I put it like that. I'm sorry, I messed up again. Undyne's the person I really want to go on a date with. But I mean, she's way out of my league. Aww, oh, this is so sad! Oh, and you're monsters, so I don't... Like, there, there's a difference. Not that you aren't cool, but Undyne, she's so confident and strong and funny. And I'm just nobody. Aww. 
for us. Oh, that's sad. You're, that's so sad. All I've ever done is hurt people. No, you haven't. You built Metaton. Told her so many lies. She thinks that I'm, she thinks I'm a lot cooler than I actually am. Oh, believe me. If all my friends knew that I just sat in my room all day and did nothing except for school and play video games, they would think I was a complete butt. Wait, I just said this over the internet. Oh no. Well, that went out. <laughs> You'll find out the truth about me. What should I do? Just say the truth! Yeesh! How many times do people tell you this? The truth? But if I tell her that, she'll hate me. Isn't it better this way? To live a lie where both people are happy? Or the truth where neither of us are? They say be yourself, but I don't really like who myself is. I'd rather just be whatever makes people like me. <laughs> No, you're right. Every day I'm scared. Scared of what will happen if people learn the truth on their own. They'll all get hurt because of me. But how can I tell on dying the truth? I, I don't have the confidence. I'm going to mess it up. How can I practice? Um, okay. How do we do this? Uh, okay. We can either be sweet, or just say OBVIOUS. Let's let's roleplay it. Being nice. Roleplay. That actually sounds kind of fun. Okay, which one of us will be undone? Okay, I would be undone. Oh, right. Well, obviously. <laughs> Hi, Undyne. How are you doing today? <laughs> You're cute. I love that. I'm fine. Ha! Ah, right, glad to hear it. Yeah, this is adorable! Anyone else think this is adorable? Not not just me? Uh, so I'd like to uh, talk to you about something. <laughs> I love that, but I'm not gonna choose it. What is it, Elpheus? Let me see, I, uh, I... I haven't been exactly truthful with you. You see, I... I... Oh, forget it. Undyed. I I want to tell you how I feel. You're, you're so brave and strong and nice. And then you're going to start ranting, aren't you? You always listen to me when I talk about nerdy stuff. You always do your best to make me feel special. Looks like telling you that you'll beat up anyone that gets in my way. Undyed. I can't take this any longer. <laughs> Whoa. Um. Hold on. Wait. Oh. What did you just say? Uh, oh no. Ooh, this is gonna end either good or bad. I mean, uh, no. I mean, well, we were, but, I mean, actually, we were on... What? I mean, I mean, a dying eye. I've been lying to you. What? About what? About, well, everything. I told you that seaweed was, like, scientific. Whoa, 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 whoa. Um... That's... Um... Please... Please try to... Close your mouth so you can listen to Undying, please. Alpheus? I, I just wanted to impress you. I just wanted to think I was smart and cool. That I wasn't some nerdy loser. Alpheus... Undyne, I really think you're neat, okay? Obvious. What? You're neat too, I guess, but you gotta realize most of what you said really doesn't matter to me. I don't care if you watch kid cartoons or read history books. Hey, all that stuff is. 
love it! That's what I like. Yeah, you're analytical. Yay! Oh, this is sweet! That's adorable! And kind of sweet. And also weird. But mostly sweet. to get Papyrus to do it. <laughs> uh, get those bones shaking! It's time to jog a hundred laps ho hooting about how great ye we are. Ready? I'm about to start the timer. And I, I'll do my best. Because I am the best Papyrus ever! You was kidding, right? Cartoons? Those comics? Those are still real, right? Anime's real, right? Um, just to make sure you're happy and you don't flip out, I'm gonna say yeah. Because it is technically real. It is real in someone else's mind. I knew it! <laughs> so is Magical Princesses. Here I come. Uh, thanks for taking care of Alex. I didn't get to say what I wanted to, but things seem like they're going to get better for her. Well, gotta go catch up with them. Later. Goodbye! Slide across the screen! Okay. That was something! I have to admit, that was something. Taking in worthless garbage fills you with determination. Oh boy! That is weird. Oh, the cooler is empty. That is... Oh. Howdy! If it isn't my good friend who trusts me. This is Papyrus. You also, also, you're also a mutual friend. Alphys and I finished our training early. Very early. So I sent her home. Very old. Uh, now, I feel strongly for, and for no fair reason, you should also go there, to her lab house. I have, on, I have only good feelings about this. Goodbye. Thank you, Papyrus. Yes, that's no problem. You are so sweet. That is, that is awesome. Let's go and see. What the? Did anyone else seal see something? I, I seal. I see, seal. Seal. I seal. I see, seal. Like, I can't. I can't talk. My brain is broken. I can't. I can't speak. Blech. Yeah, this is what happens when about three hours of recording does to you. It melts your brain. The neck stretches infinitely into the cosmos. What? Don't worry about it. Okay, what was that, and why did that say that? I am concerned. Okay. Come again sometime, tra-la-la. La-la-la, -la. I am singing as the weird guy that has a lamp for a face. At least that's what I think he is. Hello there! Alpheus? You home? Alpheus? Huh. Oh, a note. It's a note from Alpheus. Read it? Yeah! It's hard to read because of the handwriting, but you try your best. Hey, thanks for your help back there. You guys, your support really means a lot to me, but as difficult as to say this, you guys alone can't magically make my own problems go away. I want to be a better person. I don't want to be afraid anymore. And for that to happen, I have to be able to face my own mistakes. I'm going to start doing that right now. I want to be clear. This isn't anyone else's problem but mine. But if you don't ever hear from me again, if you want to know the truth, enter the door on the north of this note. You will all at least deserve to know what I did. That's all she wrote. It's an elevator? Okay. I thought it was a bathroom.
Well, that sucks. That was a really rough ra landing. Oh! Entry number one. This is it. Time to do what the king has asked me to do. I will create the power to free us all. I will unleash the power of the soul. Oh, that sounds pretty cool. The barrier is locked by soul power. Unfortunately, this power cannot be recreated artificially. Soul power can only be de derived from what was once living. So to create more, we will have to use what we have now, the souls of monsters. That doesn't sound good. But extracting a soul from a living monster would require incredible power. Besides being impractical, doing so would instantly destroy the soul's host. And unlike the persistent souls of humans, the soul of most monsters disappear immediately upon death. If only I could make a monster soul last. I've done it! Using this blueprints, I've extracted it from the human soul. I believe this is what gives their souls the strength to persist after death. The will to keep living. The resolve to change fate. Let's keep- let's call this power... Determination. And... So... We see a note. There's a note on the ground. You can't make it all out. Elevator, lost power, enter the center door. That's all you can read. Power room. Buy chips for 25. Vending machine dispenses some chips. And that's it for this episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this episode, please, I don't know, just say, just think to yourself, oh, hey, this was good. I really, I'm just doing this to have a good time. If you have a good time watching these, then great. I'll see you guys next episode and all you other people as well. In the next episode where we will go to the corners of this room so, and figure out where Alpheus is. See you next time. Bye.